In this class, we'll study about modeling the residence driveway ramp. This is the second challenging task as we'll have to adjust it to the very terrain slant. Take a look at the scene. The cutout has already been applied to the ramp by applying the Boolean command. The road and the sidewalk were modeled based on the techniques studied in the course. Let's select the floor, driveway reference line, the terrain, and the sidewalk. Then assess the quad menu and click Isolate Selection. This tool is very useful for clearing the scene and hiding other displayed objects. See how now only the selected elements are displayed in the scene. Let's create a rectangular base for creating the ramp. Click Rectangles in the Shapes category. Enable the Auto Grid mode. Auto Grid ignores the displayed grid in the object being created. A grid is based on a face. See how the rectangle was created conforming to the floor face. We can adjust the rectangle to correctly fit the base. There is a middle line to show the direction of the driveway ramp in the important reference lines. See how we have created this line based on the guideline object. It is straight and we need to move the line to comply with the specification. Select the vertex and drag it to the terrain line. The base and reference are ready. Now we'll convert the base to an editable poly. A face has been created. Select this face and assess the Extrude Along Spline command. In Pick Spline, select the guideline. See how the face extrusion conforms to the created line. Let's adjust this command so that it complies to the design on the floor plan.
This tool is quite useful for extrusions, as it provides a great deal of possibilities. Take a look at the results. The driveway ramp is almost ready now. Let's place it more correctly based on the street line. So now you see the driveway ramp has been created for the design. Now delete the final face. Enable the edge selection mode and extrude the upper edge to close the opening in the walkway and the street. Now the mock-up displays all the elements in the modeled scene. So in this class we have studied about adapting driveway ramps to conform to the terrain slope in the design. This is one of the main challenges in mock-up creation. But you can easily achieve it by employing the software tools. There are several. Let's use our creativity to leverage their possibilities and show your skill to the market.